Okay guys, in today's video, we're, we're gonna be bringing you a perch catch and cook and a Helgramite lure review. We already have two fish in the boat. Let's get to fishing. Ooh, I just got some. Oh, he's got it. There we go, there's another one. Oh, it's a tiny one. Third, or second perch of the day. See you, little guy. There's another. Oh, <gasps> mini bass. Oh, that is so. Look at that. Look at that tiny guy. The hook set is terrible because it's so close to his eye, but. This is a largemouth bass. The way you can tell is when you grab him by the mouth. It extends like that, but also you can tell from this lateral line. Actually, it kind of looks like a spotted bass, but it's probably a largemouth. There he goes. So what we're doing right now is just casting under docks and hoping we hook up for this catch and cook. But we always welcome all species of fish, except for trash fish, sculpin, to be exact. Those are not welcome anywhere. No, I know, but, oh, oh! Okay, <laughs> you probably couldn't see that, but a perch just came up, took me and ran. That's what I'm using for today. Silver 164 ounce trout magnet head with a brown little trailer. And the way I'm fishing it is just steady retrieve with a couple of twitches. And then when I see that the fish is following it, I pause it and I just twitch it. Action has died down. As I say that, Carson hooks up. Rock bass. It's a chunky, chunky little fish. What time is it? Lunker lotion time. This stuff works. I can't tell if that's a fish or weed. Oh, it's just a tiny, tiny fish. We're going to that dock right there. Should be fish under it, hopefully, and that's what the plan is. And if not, we'll just keep going to the one next to it. Oh, oh, that was a bass. Ooh. Oh, there's another one. Okay, look at this guy's stomach. He's been eating good. Full stomach, he's been eating. Okay. Off he goes. Amazing. Oh, big bass, right there. Where? Right there. Where? You see him? No. Right there. Straight ahead, straight ahead, straight ahead. Oh, I see it. Oh! <gasps> oh! <laughs> That nice! Is Hold on. What we like to On the see. drop. There he goes. And now we're under the docking. That's fine. We're sticking with light cycle now. And as we move on throughout the day, we're going to be, I guess, scaling it up. So we went from that little trap magnet to this little this little swim bait so we're not gonna dab it up with lunker lotion just yet Sit down. Oh, boy. I missed the bench oh that hurt 
That did not feel good. My butt hurts now. Push this off. That did not feel good at all. Rule number one, be aware of your surroundings. Uh, that's not a rule. That's a statement. <laughs> that is a fact. Alright guys, so today I'm bringing you a video on this Nico Helgramite. Now this little guy is amazing. Um, it is a 3 inch soft plastic body, but the amazing part is you can do this indestructible so the best part about it is that it's biodegradable meaning if you lose it if you break it off if it just comes off with the fish it will dissolve over time and it does no harm to the environment so i'm going to show you tips and tricks on how to rig this up so you yourself can be catching more fish so what i fish it on is i have this one eighth ounce gamakatsu jig head and you just normal with your jigs you thread it on Now the one tough part about this, since the plastic is tough and you can stretch it out, is threading it on. But if you do a good job, it shouldn't be that difficult. So now with this 1 8 ounce jig head, the hook tip should be coming out about a third of the way. So I'll show you in one moment once I get it rigged up. Now this is a really poor job of rigging it up. But it should look something like that. Something it should look like, but this would be straight normally. I just did a rush job. Now fishing it like this, you'll be getting bites very often. If there's fish around, they'll be hitting this. But what I sometimes do is I add a trailer hook. This is a size two gamakatsu, just a normal hook. And what you do is you thread it on and you use something to block it from coming off. And that is that is perfect because when you get short strikes like that or swipes, you'll hook up with this trailer hook because without this trailer hook, fish comes up, bites it, you don't hook up. But if you're using this little trailer hook, even short strikes, you will end up hooking up. All right, so now we're gonna be going fishing. We're doing a perch catch and cook already. And so we're at three fish and we should be hooking up and catching a lot more with this Nico helper mate. We'll see you out there. Okay guys, we're at this brand new spot. Docks. Probably not even long. Two minutes in. Getting bites on the Helgramite. On the grub. We still don't have enough yet for the catch and cook, but we're getting there and this Helgramite is gonna take us there. See you guys on the chest cam. We're on the chest cam. Let's, let's get to fishing. So all I did with this hugger mine is I just dropped it under the dock. All right there, let it sink all the way to the bottom. Now we're at about like eight, nine feet here. Reel it up and just twist it a little bit. Let's see if he comes back for it. He didn't have it. He didn't have it. wasn't enough to convince him there, so you know what time it is. Oh boy. It's lunker lotion time. Yeah, so if you're using any sense with this little hugger mite, what you want to do is apply it on the appendages here. That's all you got to do. Just a tiny bit here towards the midsection. And you just want to spread it out among the appendages. Now what that'll do is that'll increase by chances because of the scent, but it'll also increase visibility because of the little highlights on That's the helper mite, folks. And you see little accents on the appendages? That's that lunker lotion working. Let's get a release on this guy. There he goes. On the 
Next fish. Oh. Good? <laughs> yeah, we're good. Oh. I'm getting bit. I'm getting bit. Carson? Do you want to explain why there's no fish in the boat right now? Do you want to explain why there's no fish in the boat right now? Do you want to explain why there's no fish in the boat right now? Other than that? Why? Because there was one biting me. And then you pulled the that was not the jig fault. off of the uh, no. the dock. It was user error, you suck. Uh, okay. I can make you fall right now. No, you. Stop. Oh. Oh my gosh. Stop, yeah, stop, 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 stop. No, 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 not this. My trailer hooks. Got him. Got a fish. Got a fish. Can you record? Yeah, you got on the cocoa, too. Oh, yeah. You're hooked up on this hogan mite. Oh, oh, that's a beauty. No! Um... I want to sit down. Okay, well, you saw that the hugger might works. <laughs> it's just not me. <laughs> Do you want me to stop recording? I want that fish. I think that's a yes. I was like a quarter pound bass. <laughs> On this, if I'd brought that in, ah. Oh. Pro. Hopefully you saw that because that was a freaking that was actually that would have been nice. Got him. Oh. That's a perch. That's a perch. Oh, there we go. He look at that. Right in the Hold middle on. of. Right in the nostril. That's where you want to hook set him. Look, I'm about to show you how deep this hugger mine is. See, contorted this hugger mite is. It was deep in this perch, and I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to take it off. Uh, I... Right, oh. so chomped by bass, destroyed by rockfish. And let me tell you, rockfish have intense, intense teeth. Still holding up. Guys, I'm telling you, this is the bait to catch fish on. Oh! We're cutting it. We're cutting it. We're cutting it. <laughs> okay. Redo? No. Actually, yeah. If you want to catch fish, this is the bait. And lunker lotion, obviously. Yeah. And smacked up a little bit. Got him. Got another fish. Oh, 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 oh. That's a bass. That's a bass. Let's go! On that Helgramite. Look at. I'm gonna have to show you this. That thing is inhaled. That is gone. Guys, I'm telling you right now, if you want to be catching fish like this on the daily, every time you go fishing, this Nico Hulkermite is the bait. Fish away for this guy, 1.23 pounds. There you go. It feels good. It feels good. Now let's get a release on this guy. Fish will release. On that new poker mine. Go, go, go. go. Dedication. You put your phone in the water. Yeah. And then, and then we can play. Oh my god. That's it. Oh. <gasps> oh! I thought that was a <laughs> Guys, 
Hold on, I'm gonna have to stand up for this. Guys, can you tell me that you've been catching different types of species, especially sunfish, look, this big on that Helgramite? I mean, guys, I'm telling you right now, this is the only bait you'll need to catch fish. The only bait you'll need. Look, this guy's got chompers. He's got some gnarly teeth on. Oh, he's got parasites on him. Guys. I'm, I can't even express in words how good this Helgramite is. We're gonna have to get a release on this guy. On that Helgramite. Incredible, incredible lure. Let's get back to fishing. This is a small mouth. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. I'm telling you, this Helgramite catches every single fish that there is. Let's get this guy back in the water. Hooked up on this perch, and look at this. Absolutely insane. Can you tell me where that Helgramite is? I'll show you. It is absolutely inside of that fish. It's another one. So we just finished cooking these these little chips right here, or these fish. We're gonna do a taste test. We have no idea how these are gonna taste. No, we'll let you know. Okay guys, so we're chilling here with the, the fish we just fried. So Carson tried his Frank's hot sauce and that's what this is. Who knows how that's gonna end up. And then we just have the normal fish and chips. So, tell me if they're done correctly. Normal. Tastes like it. Carson tries first fish and chips. Honestly, I'm not recording. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try this Frank's hot sauce. <laughs> this does not look appetizing <laughs> at all. Google it's God did it, so I thought I could do um, it. Um, the meat looks kind of cooked. Let's have to try it. The meat's done, yeah. Can you taste the... You Well, you don't get hot, but you do kind of get the sauce. Okay. If you're wondering, these these perfectly golden ones are the ones I cooked. No, and no. And these, no, no, uh... No, no. Not done. The person <laughs> who never... Ones. Try, never made fish in his life. And okay, I'm not gonna eat that one. Good first Let's attempt. See if this one's this. That one's good. It's just the outside part. Uh, no, it's fully cooked. It was it was only longer for these. The first one looked like that. You're not even gonna try your No. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yeah, these aren't done, and I don't want to risk it. So. <laughs> Perks from Lake Washington are already bad enough, but not cooking full is <laughs> kind of pushing. Okay, so that concludes today's video. Hope you guys liked it. Please subscribe, because we'll be dropping more content like this soon. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you next time.